Hey everybody, it's Paul. Uh, I'm just coming back from Spartanburg, South Carolina to an upwards uh, basketball coaches clinic. It had probably about, I'm terrible with numbers, probably about maybe 25, 30 coaches from across the state of South Carolina, high school coaches and a couple college coaches. And uh, it's such a neat event. It's kind of a pinch in for Adrian. They asked for Adrian, but he was in another another location this weekend. So it's great to be a part of a team where we can help pinch in for each other when needed locally. And um, But I'll tell you, I had a blast because it's all high school basketball coaches. Of course, I used to play and then coach and then chaplain in that area and uh and so it's just real neat to remind them that uh that that the lord uh deeply sees and cares about them but about the game of basketball because god nudged long ago a guy named james naismith to, to notice some people and to win people to the to christ through the gym and how what they're doing is, is really there because of jesus <laughs> and jesus deeply cares I, I i said this but i probably shouldn't have i said well, it might be there for it might be that jesus's favorite game is basketball but i'm i can't prove that biblically um, because of that. And so just to see that, walk through some fear, like some of the things I think get in the way of faith and basketball to them can be the fear and the pressure and the fear of failure of things. And so what does truth look like in that? And one of the things I think was really great, um, uh, when it kind of opens up for questions, we had some good thoughts of people that have different belief systems on their team and how do you get, how can you reach people who are always on their phones? And, and so just giving them some, some tips and ideas in that, but also kind of putting Forge's website in their hands and also the multiplying movements, which I'm asking that you pray that, that whoever needs to, they took the, they took the uh, website, they took the app, they took the multiplying movements, that God would use that on their teams to spark a movement that multiplies for the cause of Christ in the sports world and beyond, uh, those high schools and beyond, and colleges and beyond. Um, so just continue to pray for that. Thank you uh, for praying. I told them y'all were all praying for them, and they were super encouraged. I challenged them to build them a prayer team for their basketball people that more and more people are praying for them as i told them you would be praying for them and have been as well so thanks uh i cannot tell you how awesome it is to do ministry together with you uh love y'all